Good morning everybody. It is opening weekend for muskie here in southern Wisconsin. Yesterday we went out. Kind of a hard to lead on the footage. Caught a lot of fish though. A lot of pike. So I think I caught 12 pike. Had a muskie follow. Caught a bass. So now we're going different body of water. Hopefully a little bit more action. Heard good things about how the day went yesterday for some people. So we're going to be chucking probably small bucktails, small chatterbaits, and then we got a bluegill hanging off the back of the boat there. So that might be the ticket today. We will see. I'm going to get to cast. Feeling bassy. Oh boy. Not the hog we're looking for. Best part about bass fishing for muskies this time of year is you get to catch more than just muskies. Little tiny guy. There's a hog bass in here, but that was looking more like bait. There we go. Oh, there's a bass. I figured that was going to happen eventually. <laughs> Looked on the outside of the face, so that's weird. <laughs> Here we go. Second fish. Not a terrible bass. Big muskie, dude. Big muskie. Big follow on the clickbait. <laughs> Didn't come quite close enough to take a look at my bluegill hanging there, but dang. This is not good with this light of rod. Oh man. I got both motors down. I cannot come around this, I don't think. And I got no leader. Switched over to bass fishing. And he's all wrapped up. All wrapped up. And I'm hooked on my. Oh, that's bad. There we go, little guy. Heck yeah, dude. We got a little window here. This boat over here just... Whew, wow. That boat over there said they just hooked and lost one. I just had a big fish follow. So... 
There's a beautiful hook, dude. That's the Guggen clickbait. I literally just bought this for spring muskie fishing, which seems a little ridiculous, but dude, this thing is pinned. There we go. Okay, quick little drink and to the bump. First muskie of the year. Heck yeah. Thirty-four. Thirty-four. All right, we're gonna spin the boat quick. Cause the lighting's probably terrible. All right, there we go. This thing's getting beat up, probably up really shallow here, spawning. Okay. Here we go. Last look. Sorry for the bad lighting. There we go. But I'm pumped up, dude. Thirty-four. It's first fish of the year. Let's go. Let's. Freaking go, dude. <laughs> All right, so we're just checking everything over. I'm just running 40 pound braid, the Guggen clickbait, which I didn't like at first, but then I realized you can like bend this back and forth and tune it. So it was like riding on top of the water because this was bent too far forward. So I just tipped it back and now it's like perfect. So like now depending on the depth I'm fishing in, I can tip it forward or back and it runs deeper or shallower. So like this, I don't know man, we'll see. This is my first time really using this thing, so see how she holds up to multiple muskies. <laughs> Big muskie in front of us. Do you see it rutting around? Oh, is that a big carp? I think it's a big carp. I think there's way too much muck down there to... Yeah, <laughs> that was a big carp. All right, thought it was a muskie. We're running a little bluegill, a little bobber. When I see him, I'm gonna pop this over at him. Um, just caught this at the boat launch and just leaving her in the water back here until I actually see one. That's just on a really crappy sucker rod. And that last muskie came on a, well, I have the, this is two different silver maxes combined into one. So it's 75% of one uh, silver max and about 25% of a different silver max on a real live black rod. I got my other 13 fishing reel in the mail last night and I didn't put it together. So that's where we're running, 40 pound braid, Guggen clickbait. The clickbait goes down, dude. There's the skirt. Well, maybe I'm not a big fan of the Guggen clickbait, dude. Can't even keep a skirt on it. Jeez. only color skirts I have to fix this with are white so I guess we're going white see how that pops up there with that bait hanger on there I don't know if it's gonna work yeah it looks like those are tied on it just fell off now the bait hanger is on cleared okay we go. Alright, there's our new Guggen clickbait with a white skirt.
just a beetle guy, a little stalker actually. It's a leecher. That's actually crazy. <laughs> Look at, wait till you see the spots on this guy. Again, we clickbait. Look at the spots on this little guy. That's a gorgeous fish. Absolutely beautiful. These fish are going to be getting into this chain and be getting big soon. This is probably last year's stockling. Oh, that, I'm wet. I wasn't filming on my head cam. That's terrible. That's disgusting. Jesus, that thing clobbered it. I guess I can film when I'm catching bass, but I can't film when I'm catching muskie. So, little guy, probably like a 13 and a half, maybe 14. All right, so there's a muskie up there in like a couple inches of water. It's gonna be bluegill popping, I guess. Oh, he's moving towards it. Kind of. His fins are out of the water, dude. Man, spooked it. It really wanted the bluegill though. All right, we are just making the last little pass towards the boat launch here and then we're heading out for the day. Pretty actually fantastic opening weekend of fishing for me. So, I mean, no footage from yesterday, but I caught a lot of fish. And then today, catching the two muskies, that's honestly the most I think I've ever caught on opener. Maybe not the biggest fish, but a pretty good way to kick it off. Um, so I'm excited to get back out here a whole lot this season, more than last season. Um, so the goal to beat is beating 12 muskies for the year, and I'm at two. So thank you for watching, and we will catch you on the next video.